Hey, Vinny Bash. It is the first day of January 2022. And this year is really shaping up to be quite a ride, in my humble opinion. January, Janus, the two-faced god. Also the god of coinage, in case you didn't know. And it just so happens that Israel has approved a new bank in their country for the first time in over 40 years and ironically the name of that bank is one zero which makes a 10. this is just incredibly interesting to me that this would come about literally at the end of the 33rd year since the world currency announcement by the rockefeller mouthpiece economist one zero hmm ten that's just incredibly interesting and not to mention the fact that they just had a ten country simulation of a major cyber attack on world markets a ten day drill and i stood upon the sand of the sea and saw beast rise up out of the sea having seven heads and ten horns and upon his horns Ten crowns. I think you see where I'm going with this. Let's read on. One zero, the newest bank in Israel. Go figure, in over 40 years. A fully digital bank. A lot of interesting tidbits in here. I will definitely link this article. One zero is also the triumph of technology because they triumph over lost time and availability all these lures to you know convenience and security which is all just to lure you in to the block chains that's why it's in hebrew english and binary one zero because it's a blockchain system that once you are latched into it you're chained i call it the blockchain of darkness a bank with artificial and human intelligence combined. Blah, 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 blah. Look at this. It also joined with an investor, Chinese tech conglomerate, Tencent. Um, hello, Tencent. Just saying. Ten day, ten country cyber drill just two weeks ago. Yeah, I'd say something's brewing. And like I told you, there's a ton of stuff in here that just screams what they're doing. There's coming a financial calamity, if you will, that is going to disrupt the currencies and financial systems of the world, and they're going to suck you into this blockchain. Don't do it. This is combining with the technology and the vaccines and green passes. You are being trapped, snared into the block chains because the blockchain will monitor everything not just your financial but everything about you the social credit system and it's all going to be run out of sodom and egypt i mean israel just keep this in mind you guys this is coming and it's coming fast in my opinion so have your affairs in order okay First thing and foremost you need to do is make sure that you have an active relationship with the Savior, Jesus Christ. If you're not doing this, you will be deceived and you will be thrust into great tribulation. You do not want this. You are not going to withstand it. You're not going to survive it. You're not going to outwit it. And you're not going to constitutionally defeat it. This is happening. It's biblical, period. How everything we see is absolutely perfectly matching up with the seals being opened in Revelation 6. Every single seal up to the, at least the fourth seal is so clearly in front of our faces. If you're denying it, then you're delusional. And I'm actually praying for you. Call on the name of Jesus with a sincere, humble heart knowing you, the world, need a Savior, and He is it. I love each and every one of you. I want to see you in heaven. I truly do. And Jesus is the only way to the Father. End of discussion.
Links in description. God bless each and every one of you. Peace and grace to you. Any fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, 